Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Anya, and this is Fallout 76 Wastelanders. Oh yeah, man, it's weird to be back, that's for sure. I have been playing pretty much every day uh, to do daily challenges and things, work on my score, get up through the scoreboard. We can take a look real quick at uh, where I'm at. It's getting towards the end as well, but I'm up here. Uh, rank 93, so I only have, you know, seven more to go to get to the very end. Uh, they've upped the number of challenges now from eight per day up to ten, and then from ten per week up to twelve, so that's pretty good. Uh, feels a little bit overwhelming at first glance, but it's all pretty simple stuff, so pretty typical. But that's not why we are here. I will be doing those uh, mostly off camera because they're kind of boring uh, to do. But I have been waiting ages. We need to do these ally quests, for sure. But um, what I've been waiting ages for is this, the Novice of Mysteries. We've had these quests for a very long time, and I've really been wanting to, to work on them. So, let's see. It would be Forging a Legend, uh, Blade of Bastet, Hollow Tape, uh, Phantom Device, Hollow Tape, and then what? what's the last one? Yes, Voice of Set. Okay, so we'll do all of these. Uh, oh, Queen of the Hunt shouldn't be up right now. I activated that one for money, because that's 125 caps if you get that one. And so yeah, Master of the Tools of Mister Mistress of Mystery uh, set will be a lot of fun. We'll turn that one off just because it's, uh, it's a lot to look at. And then we'll get into the hollow tapes here. Hollow. We've got Order of Mysteries, right? Oh, here we go. Blade of Bastet. In combat, the Mistress of Mystery relied upon her speed, agility, and training in the martial arts, including the art of the sword. For many years, her favorite weapon was the Blade of Bastet, a legendary sword passed down from hero to... <laughs> Sorry about that. I should have known that it would uh, turn off, but I wish it would have told me the entire name of the thing here. In combat, the Mistress of Mystery relied upon her speed, agility, and training in the martial arts, including the art of the sword. For many years, her favorite weapon was the Blade of Bastet, a legendary sword passed down from hero to hero across the ages. The time has come for you to earn your own blade. First, you'll need to locate a sword with historic significance. That symbolism matters. You'll treat it with respect. Cryptos should have some leads. Then you'll need to pick up one of Frederick's swing analyzers and attach it to your sword. The analyzer will collect data on your stance and swing as you wield it against different foes. Once the analyzer has finished its work, Frederick should be able to hone your sword into a blade worthy of the Mistress of Mystery. Amazing. Well, pretty excited about this sword then. Search cryptos for a historic sword. Get a swing analyzer from the fabricator. Okay. This guy is amazing because uh, one of the weekly objectives is to buy and sell things 25 times. Yeah, so I think he's completing that in my vending machine, and uh, that'll complete that for me as well. So, big love for him. I really appreciate that. Uh, Winnipeg guy, you are a legend. Okay, so we'll find Kryptos. Is that in the old hideout? Yeah. Speaking of uh, historic swords, though, I picked up... I can't remember now where I got it. But I have a meteoric sword, uh, which is pretty epic, actually. It has an old, like, Viking-style uh, hilt. And then, uh, like, a Damascus steel-style blade there. Very cool. It's not a legendary. It doesn't have any uh, special, special goodness to it. But it's a very cool-looking sword. So, I wish I could use that in this... Uh, for, for this uh, quest or whatever, but sadly it won't be a thing. Alright, let's head here. Oh, 
Now what I really ought to do is look, here we go. This is what I really need. Let's pull out the old shish kebab and shish, shish this bob right here. Dead. I went ahead and put on the friendly fire uh, perk card and got rid of my electrified revolutionary sword so that I could just use this uh, all the time. And that way if I'm in a quest with allies, NPC allies, I could just heal them whenever I need to. So that's why I've swapped over to this. I think it's this one. I don't think it's the one standing open. I thought it had an arrow inside, though. Maybe not. Okay. Oh, maybe all three of them will work uh, to bring me down here, then. That's pretty good. I've seen some other Pulowski shelter uh, containers with arrows inside of them that were hidden elevators, but I haven't used them yet. Oh, I need my veil on, is the issue. I keep it on me. You know I keep that thing on me. Hello? Will it reset if I back off and come back? Okay, that's stupid. <laughs> that's stupid. It should have noticed that I had the veil on while I was standing right in front of it. Hi. Oh man. It's been a long time since I've been down here. Uh, but I need to stay focused. Let's head over here and get the objective done. Okay. I guess I'm just supposed to use the terminal, but the, the objective is kind of in there already. Do we fabricate a new sword? Is that what we're up to? System and fabrication services. Oh, swing analyzer is what we need. Cool. Hello? Should it not have spit it out right there? I feel like it did before. I can't make another one, so did it drop it straight into my inventory somewhere? Maybe miscellaneous swing analyzer? No. I can't see anything with the stupid lighting effects. It's not a miscellaneous at least. What else would it be under, though? I guess it could be a mod. Yeah, it is. Swing analyzer. Okay. Search for a historic sword. Watch it be some silly revolutionary sword that I don't want. Log in. Um, is it database queries? Yeah, historic swords. There we go. Perfect. Running preset query. Searching database for historic sword done. Pre-war archives indicate a historic sword may be found in White Spring Presidential Cottage. Please acquire the sword. Complete the swing analyzer process. Return it to the production facility for processing. All right. Will do. Let's head there immediately. Oh. I guess the golf club is the nearest... Objective then, or point. Oh no, come on now. There we go, now we made it. This place is usually rife with uh, enemies. Ghouls, mostly. Oh yeah, what'd I say? Look game, I'm trying to play here, okay? I don't need these stupid lag spikes. These obscene lag spikes. If you're not gonna let me uh, attack people. At 
least let me get somewhere safe. Oh no. Too close. Oh no. This van's gonna go too. Soon. Yeah. Boom. It's always very dangerous around here. <laughs> it's not even because of the monsters. Oh, that's a stingwing. Got in on that action. Nice. Sure, I'll take another one of those. I only have about a thousand. Nice. I really don't need the Stingwing, so I'm not even going to go looking for it. That was pretty wild, though. I'm glad the lag didn't kill me. It was close. Could have. Let's go right up where he came down at. And head up here. How do we get in here? Isn't this usually locked? It's not locked right now. Let's not blow myself up with the explosive bullets. Hi. Right. Dead. Another one coming, though. Nice try. Oh no, I'm very damaged though. I shouldn't be taunting him like that. Come on. Come on, hit the guy. Nope. Let me heal. Even when my mouse button doesn't get stuck down, sometimes uh, the game thinks I'm trying to charge a shot when I'm not. And it doesn't allow me to do anything until that shot goes off. We live though. We're still here. I really need to rejig my perks so that um, I'm a little more survivable because I really am like a not even a glass cannon because I don't even do that much damage either. <laughs> I really need to work on uh, my perks and things. Okay, is this going to be locked? It is. Uh, that is a meteoric sword. Amazing. So I could probably break down the one in my inventory and it would surprise me staff access. Valid password is required. Find the terminal password. You would, game. I'd be surprised if the Meteoric Sword has any kind of mods for it. Uh, but if I break it down on a weapons workbench, I'll probably be able to find it. Okay, yeah, that's, that's the item. I would imagine the password is going to be somewhere in the vicinity. One would think, right? Oh, I almost missed that. Popplehead. Perception. Take that starch. A little bit of glue. Aha! Presidential Cottage password. A regular stealth boy. Mintats? Nope, right away. Toothbrush I'll take. I get low on plastic really easily. Huh. I saw a hollow tape in there for some reason. I should have known that it wasn't, though, because there was no light. I'm taking the plasma rifle for mods. Okay. What I say earlier about staying focused? Haha. Ha. You guys know me better than that. Look, hush. It's a great song, but hush. All right. Display case access. Open. Uh, remote door control. Multiple faults detected. Security recording. No. Oh. Security tape drive is full. Oh, really? It's only open for a limited time? Only? Display case. Open. Ridiculous. Grant Saber. Okay. So it's not even a meteoric sword. 
That's cool, though. It's the same design. Attach the swing analyzer, so we'll have to do that at a, we uh, at a weapons workbench anyway. Should be fine. You know, I think after this we're going to have to kill things, so I don't think I want... I was considering going here and just attaching it straight on to there, and then continuing with the quest, but I don't think that's the way it goes. And this obviously isn't ideal for me because I'm not built uh, as a melee character, hence the whole glass cannon thing. I thought I shut that last time I was here. Oh well. Okay, modify repair. Oh, I feel strange without a hat on. Um. Yeah, there's no mods for this. And the blade doesn't have as nice a design as the meteoric sword. I don't see the meteoric sword here, though. So I guess it's not even capable of being modified or repaired. I've repaired it before. Huh. Okay, well. Swing analyzer attached. There. Oh, my Gatling gun's almost dead. So let's get that fixed up. Any day now. Man, the perks that uh, add that extra durability really throw the game for a loop. It's like it doesn't have a clue what it's, uh, what it's doing. Okay, kill six different types of creatures with Grant's Saber. Uh, it may not be... Uh, let's do. Let's go ahead and favorite it to here. So that I can quick select it w uh, with the wheel. Alright, well, let's find some weaklings. Oh, I thought it was going to select it whenever I saved it onto my favorites, but it didn't. Let's find some weakling creatures to attack. Should be easy. Alright, there's usually some ghouls around here. Yeah. It's a level 50 crown. So it's not the weakest we could come up against, but it's something. Oh, come on. I was hoping to get a, uh... Wow, I'm not doing any damage to this thing. Look, go away, okay? Wow, I don't like getting stuck on rocks. I don't like getting stuck in lag, either. Yeah, we're gonna have to make some modifications here. Game! Yeah, now I'm gonna die. Because of the lag. Nice try. You missed. Wow. This is garbage. I'm gonna have to kill some much weaker creatures first. I really hate when I'm uh, right next to the guy and I can't uh, successfully attack them. Okay, his legs are done now. Okay, he's downed. Ouch. Let's go for a heal. Oh no. See, this is only going to count as one type of creature, too, for this challenge. isn't the time for this. Does R not... Okay. Do a red away and then a stim pack. There we go. So now we ought to have more health than before. Come on, game. I'm tired of having to tell it that, too. Like, jeez.
Well, this is tragic. <laughs> it's like beating them to death with a blunt spoon or something. It's stupid. Alright, where's the crown one? Here it is. Oh, these don't even count as creatures? It's not updating. Okay, checkpointed. There we go. Now it worked. Lots of good stuff on here. Yeah, my internet must just be having a hemorrhage or something. I don't know. One more. Ta-da! Okay. But, like I say, it's not different kinds of creatures. It was only the one... I think I'm... Uh, got red worms now. Yeah, four minutes. I'm not going to worry about that. I am thirsty, though. After all that swinging, not surprised. I don't know if you're a swinger or not, but it's thirsty work. I'll tell you that right now. Oh, I said I was going to uh, make some changes. Uh, let's get rid of the heavy gunner. And let's go for uh, Gladiator. One-shot melee. One-handed, sorry. Yeah. Regular Gladiator. Just because of the look of the card, we're going to do Master Gladiator. And I have the same number of each kind. Um, so, yeah. Let's find wrong way. Yeah, Strengths. We'll head over to... Uh, yeah. Wait a second. Master. Why can't I buy... Oh, here it is. Why is it down here? Why isn't it in alphabetical order? Yeah, we'll rank it up, and then we'll do the same one again. We'll rank it up. So now we've got rank 3 Master Gladiator. Expert... Why isn't it... Okay, yeah. This one is in alphabetical order, but buying new uh, perks is not in alphabetical order. That's so confusing. You probably noticed, too, that I have uh, damaged armor at the bottom right. Um, the armor that is damaged is garbage. It's a two-star legendary. I didn't realize until, like, yesterday. And so I'm leaving it unrepaired to remind myself to go to the purveyor and get better armor. Uh, see if I can get a, a decent legendary that would actually do me any good. Because the one that I have on is... really is garbage. Uh, I was thinking that there were mole rats and stuff around here, but... Yeah. There should be mole rats and there should be mire lurks closer down to this area. Uh, maybe along here too, along this river. So, that's my plan. That's what I'm looking for right now. Oh. There's a chicken. Dead. Taking your intestine. Sorry, buddy. Does that not count? I recovered from radworms, but it's not saying checkpointed or updated or whatever. Okay, yeah. There we go. So even... Even those kinds of animals. You know, I really ought to kill this other chicken for its intestines, too. Because I've been making sausages. Not for any particular reason, except that it, I think it's hilarious to use tick blood intestines and spoiled meat to make my food. <laughs> it's disgusting. That's kind of the same reason I got uh, the cannibal perk and um, blood sucker, blood drinker uh, perk as well, which I'm not using anymore. Oh yeah, a mole rat and a dog. Should get two creatures out of that. Because even though we didn't completely kill the mole rat, we did get a hit on it with this sword. Die. Die. We are doing a bit more damage now, thankfully. Unless it's just the creature type is the reason why. But we should get two more creatures out of that. We should be at four of six once it decides to update in 100 years. Checkpointed three. Killed a rodent. Why did that come up? What about the dog? Come on, surely the mole rat didn't kill the dog. 
And I'll get credit for that, right? No? Okay. Fine. Okay, here in old uh, Flatwoods. I'm pretty sure there's some red roaches over here at this bus stop. Yeah, where are you? Bean! Yeah, that takes me usually one shot when I'm bashing with a gun. So the fact it takes me two shots with this thing means that this sword is garbage. <laughs> I wanted to do the quest for the... Um, the fact that it's so old. I've had it for so long. You know? And just because uh, it's a very cool concept, you know? The whole Mistress of Mysteries thing. So we found them sneaking around in different places around the wastelands. It's a really intriguing sort of a story so far. So that's the reason why I was so interested in it. Not necessarily to get a new sword. I was going to say there's usually wolves up here. Or dogs. So if I can kill one of these. Wow. Yeah, I'm really not doing much damage to these guys. Come on. I'd really love to focus on just one at a time. You know, I think it's crippled now. I don't think it's going to be able to get up or attack me. So the sword does good uh, limb damage, that's for sure. All right, because they're having a hard time. Patch up. And that same thing happened to the... Uh, to the ghouls when I killed them. Let's try and stay behind him. There. Now they're both down. Yeah, it seems like they're being crippled pretty easily. Oh, somebody bought something. Office couches. Good. Thank you. Where'd the third one go? This is so tragic. I don't feel good about this. I'll let you know that right now. It makes me feel bad to uh, have the dog like this. I was raised uh, by a sniper. It's always like one shot, one kill. So just brutally, savagely beating these things to death. It, it hurts my soul. Okay. I think that there's... Probably going to be a Meyer Lurks closer to home. Yep, there we go. Uh, down around this area, so I may just fast travel to McClintock and then run down into this creek. And that's going to do it for this episode. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel, and I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.